So this is a really cool product that I have here. And when these first came out, they were very, very expensive. They're more affordable now. This one was only like 20 bucks. And I got it off of Amazon. And it's called the Beauty Airbrush System. Now you can say, wow, this is very small. Yes, but that's the good part. So sometimes when I do makeup, either for movies or different festivals or things like that, they do not have power outlets for us. Like, there was one time I did a movie out in the middle of the desert. There's no power outlets, so you can't really do airbrush, right? Wrong. And some of the events that I go to, they do not supply you power as well. Like some of the library cons or the conventions that we go to, either you have to pay extra for power or they don't have power near you. So we're going to go ahead and open this little box up right here. So this is, like I said, perfect for if there's no power around you or even if you just need something small to take because you can't take your full airbrush kit. Like I said, it comes with directions. It's going to tell you how to use it, recommendations. It even gives you troubleshooting and it tells you about your machine. So there's that. So you have this little thing right here, which this is pretty much your air compressor. It's very small, which is really handy. And then you have your gun. All you do. And I use this at a event. We had, oops, turned it on. We had an event and there was no power outlets at Glendale Library. And I saw this and I saw it was like 20 bucks because they were on sale and I was like, that's like I said, when these first came out, they're a couple hundred, even some thousand dollars, you know, spray guns. And then you have your option of what kind of face you want or can you holder for your makeup. They have this really big one, and they have this kind of medium size, and then they have this really small one. And all you do is twist it on, and they all have caps. And then you just take the cap off. And then you put your liquid right in here. And then you can put your cap on or leave it open depending on you know what you're doing. And it's battery. Like I said, it's portable so it's battery and it's rechargeable. So you just use this, charge this up. And I believe it works for an hour. That's what it says if you use it consistently. This can last for an hour. Now, it's not a bad thing to have more than one. Like, I have two of these in case something happens. Or if I have two artists working, or let's say this one dies, and then I have a backup. So it isn't a bad thing, and since they're affordable, you can actually have more than one and use it. But all you have to do is press this button, and it blows the air. It gets just like a regular airbrush. You use your button here for the control, and then you can adjust it on the back, you know, how much spray. And it has two settings on the compressor. So there's the heavy duty one, this one, and then there's a slower one. And then there's off. So you just press a button. That's the heavy duty one, the big one, the smaller one. There you go. Pretty easy. I'll show you another one of these since I put that one on. We'll put this one on. This is the middle one. So it depends on how much you're doing if you really need to hold a lot of color you know like if you're doing a base or if you're doing just multiple faces and you're just doing blush or something these are great for that otherwise the small one's really good for if you're working on someone like when I did the library I used a small one because I didn't need a whole lot of makeup and I was just doing like a Christmas elf zombie and so I you know I needed white and red and whatever so I didn't need a whole lot so I used the little one one like I said, if you're doing a lot of people, or like let's say you have two uh, artists, you have one that's just doing base, this would be great, and then you have one that's doing detail, they could use a smaller one. So really handy, really cool, and really affordable for makeup artists. Also, if you're just a starting makeup artist and you don't know if you like airbrush and you don't really want to take the next leap in buying you know, an actual air compressor, which is a couple hundred bucks, then this would be a good starter kit. Get one of these, see how you like it. If you like airbrush, some people don't, some people do. Let's say you're like, wow, this is really cool. I'm really good at it. Then you can always get a actual air compressor. But this is perfect for on the go. Or if you're out in the middle of nowhere, like I said, we live in Arizona and we did a movie out in the desert. And 
this would have been perfect. I didn't have it then, but this would have been perfect for that kind of thing. And it comes in a really nice box too, which I really appreciate. It has this really nice box that holds your airbrush. It's like, it's nice when they give you things like that, that, you know, last long. So you can actually use this more than once. Like I keep them in here and just carry it around like this for now. And that is that product. Like I said, I got it on Amazon beauty airbrush system or you could just look handheld airbrushes and they will come up but this one's a really good one I'm really impressed with it I like how it worked it worked very easy it was very portable and a lot of people when I was doing the makeup because we were doing it at our booth they would stop and look and they're like oh that's really cool you've never seen a handheld airbrush before so it is it is a look stopper people look you know and stop and look but like I said even if you're starting out as a makeup artist I would recommend something like this to start you off and then if you really like airbrush and you want to do more then you could actually buy your real airbrush kit so that is this product thanks for watching till next time I almost forgot to mention that it comes with these little airbrush cleaners too completely forgot but I can add it in and it comes with these little cleaners which are really helpful because you know airbrushes get jammed up that's like probably one of the most negative things is it get clogged so they give you these tools so you can keep it clean and you want to clean in between people as well as clean right after and before anything like that and they give you these cool little tools and they also give you a couple of different tips for your airbrush gun as well there's some tips in here that you can use different ones and then it also has a dropper which is great so if you just you know want to drop a couple of different colors or anything like that they have this little dropper in there as well that comes with your kit which is useful and then you don't have to buy this on top of you know like I said this is a great starter kit when you're brand new to airbrushing because it gives you pretty much everything you need so yeah again really cool airbrush kit comes in this handy dandy box and everything you need.